To a top story this evening, the Ministry of National Security this afternoon identified the mysterious shipwrecked vessel that has been leaking oil over the past eight days in the waters between Scarborough and Cove. It was being towed by a tug called Solo Creed and it was transporting fuel from Panama on its way to Guyana. Reporter Candice Jackson has been following the story and she has the details. The Trinidad and Tobago Coast Guard confirmed involvement of a tugboat and a barge bound for Guyana, but unaccounted for. Investigations in collaboration with local and regional agencies focus on identifying the vessels and their owners. Distinctive markings and satellite imagery track the barge towed by a tugboat called Solo Creed from Panama. Both vessels lost radar contact and never entered Guyana's waters. Casualties remain unconfirmed amidst efforts to determine the vessel's identities. This information, although bringing clarity, raises several more concerns. First of all, Chief Secretary Fali Augustin was not officially notified of the find. I, I found out, like everyone else, from a press release that I saw circling WhatsApp. And then I saw it was online, that's how I, I knew the name of the vessel. Nobody called, nobody WhatsApp me, nobody said anything officially. Coincidentally, the Chief Secretary stated he received similar information the night before and raised several questions. You really took that long to come forward and to take ownership of this? This is your vessel and you have not arrived to Tobago as yet? The island has been treated with a tier 2 disaster as a result of the continuous oil spill. You know what you were carrying and the press release does not even indicate clearly what they were carrying and the quantity of what they were carrying. The WhatsApp message I got last night says that they were carrying 5,000 metric tons of fuel. Is that true? Then there is a matter of the actual name of the badge stuck on the reef outside of Cove. And is it true that what we see as Gulf Stream is essentially perhaps an older name, the original name, and that this new name was perhaps um, something called Zoom Zoom of, of, of that sort? Also, Augustine pointed to some concerns about the vessel's owner, might involve a major energy company trying to do business in Trinidad. The WhatsApp I got last night also said that uh, the owner of, of, of this vessel actually is one of those trying to purchase the, the, the refinery um, down in point 14. Is that true? Augustin called for these questions to be answered urgently. And while Tobago continues to prioritize its cleanup efforts, I want to know how much they will pay for this. Candace Jackson, Tobago Updates, Television News.